Hey, welcome back to my channel. It has been about a month since I flew over uh, Nikola, and I wanted to see what changes have taken place since I flew over. I'm flying from a new direction. I thought I found a nice little spot to take off from, and uh, it gives me a better view of the assembly plant itself. And what I've I haven't seen much difference over the month. Now, after I left here, I went to Lucid. Now, you're going to see an incredible difference in Lucid. Uh, Lucid Motors, wow, I couldn't believe the difference. Anyway, let's go back to Nikola. Nikola's stock um, closed at 70 cents a share, a little over 70 cents a share. I bought 200 shares last month. I'm probably going to buy another 100 shares this month and you know just kind of dabble in it a little bit because... I wouldn't, wouldn't be extremely a heavy loss if uh, it went down to zero. I don't think it will. It's one of the companies that could take off if they get the right backing, and I think they will long term because it's really a product that we need in the United States and uh, actually the world is uh, electrified transport for short-range trucks. So what I did this time is fly about 200 feet over. What I wanted to do is take some stills um, and that way, there's some of you out there that are much sharper than I am that can count these trucks. And I'll come back in another month and take it again and see if we see any changes in uh, Nikola as far as their trucks. I did. I actually did find one surprise that I've never noticed before. Because of the angle I came at before, I kind of bypassed uh, the very last part of the video that I shot uh, of their their uh, their track that they use for testing the vehicles. And I found that there's like uh, 15 or 20 vehicles over there in addition to these that I've never noticed before. Uh, there's a picture of the test track right there. And it's kind of nice that they have one. They have a lot of acreage. And I'm really pitching for them. I really hope that they do well and get their act together and sell their units. Um I'd like to approach them and say, hey, what are you going to do with all those lithium-ion batteries? I could use a couple hundred kilowatt hours for my home storage. It could burn up! No. But anyway, I'd keep it separate from my building this time. Any lithium-ion battery, uh, lithium batteries are going to be outside, protected, away from my inverters. But anyway, uh, well, thank you for uh, joining me. If you have... The courage to subscribe. I'm trying to get over a thousand subscribers. I'm very, very close. I've been going at this, what, four or five years now? Uh, very much enjoyed uh, being on YouTube and learning from YouTube myself. But anyway, thank you again for watching and uh, have a nice day. See ya.